Hey guys, um, how y'all doing tonight? Um, hope y'all doing good and uh, having a good uh, Friday night. Uh, I keep thinking it's Saturday for some reason, but you know, that's just me. Um, so I'm gonna. This is gonna be like a mix between what James Shear does with what y'all collect and my haul from today. Um, a few of you who watch on a regular, whenever I get new uh, videos up, uh, as in like PB&J 1972, you know, we all call him PJ, well, in the group that we all have. Uh, James here, if you're watching, you know, this is a, a reply or since, you know, everyone seems to be into the What Y'all Collect videos. I mean, you're starting a nice trend, man. First you did it with the... Um, Getting everybody into the drag buses, uh, the, uh, David Chang's, um, um, Custom City over there, and then uh, you got PJ going into it, you got uh, Charlie, or is it Count Five, one, one of them, um, and now me, I've been watching some, trying to get my hands on one, um, so yeah, uh, so this is going to be the first portion where it's uh, what y'all collect, well, I started collecting today. Something I've seen a few times at uh, Toys R Us. I've only seen it at Toys R Us. I mean, apparently you can get it at Walmart and Kmart, but I, I never seen them there. And I'm only gonna, and I only started collecting these things today because they were on clearance at uh, Toys R Us. I know this ain't diecast related, but this isn't a diecast video. This is a what y'all collect video. So, I mean, I'm gonna end it with some diecast. And Hot Wheels, mainly Hot Wheels. I didn't get many. I didn't get no Matchbox today, or um, any Maestos, or um, Jadas. I've been seeing some Jadas lately. That are really like this Jada truck line. Just trucks. They got like the 124 scale out now. Wow. I mean, all right. Um, so as you can see in front of you, there are these four cards. And they um and they say uh Dag Dagadam Dag Dagadin they Dagadar they say Dagadars they're like they're like giant balls um <laughs> yeah no pun intended so in, in, insert your own thoughts there big balls all right um they're like marbles but they when I when I wanted to show you on the back I wanted to pack. This is the box for the um, carrying case that you get. You can get the Toys R Us in 98 cents. Uh, clear, clear, clear. And they come with one ball. And uh, they come with one ball and uh, one carrying case. As you can see, here's the carrying case. And uh, they got like a little face on them. Uh, when you go like this, you can open it to reveal the ball that's inside. And uh, in here, Michelle has... I mean, can we see why? It's like a pinkish purple. But these things are steel cord. And they, uh, well, in, in retrospect, they're steel, which means it's kind of like a die cast metal. So, yeah, I mean, they're heavy. And they're, they're not like room, but they're like, they're interesting. Um, and then uh, you can fit three of them in here. Um, and here's the other one that she has. Um, wonder if we can stand there and you guys can see it. Oh, it's too far down. Can we put it up here? Um, but there's that one. They, they come with a little stand. And, um, yeah, it's pink. You all, you all see it's pink. Come in a little stand, which is pretty cool. And, uh, oh, he just ran away. <laughs> but we'll go up close with this one. I mean, the detail on the on the ball is pretty cool. And they got this, uh, I guess, collector number on the back with a symbol. 
but uh, there's also like a checklist thingy and uh, whatnot. Where do they? Here, I got it. Got her in the ball. And then you just click this thing down, get the ball in there, pick it back up, and it's inside. See, there's nothing there. Um, but what I wanted to get these for on top of, you know, they're just really cool looking and I'm into them. And I'll show you the ones I got. I got the, I got the green carrying case and I got this little, um, they come in two packs. They're pretty neat. Yeah, I think they are. And this one, for some reason, it's like a, it's, it's like rubber. It's like on the outside so maybe this is a rare one I'm not too sure yet so if anyone has any uh, info about these little things you know, let me know I mean they got some Star Wars ones I gotta get this Star Wars case there's a Star Wars case they're helmets and they're like motion sensor helmets and when you walk in front of them or anything moves in front of them they uh, open up to reveal three of your balls inside just on display and then they say it's a line from the movie or whatever, but like they have Boba Fett, Darth Vader, and uh, Rex, one of the clone troopers from the Clone Wars. Um, I gotta get me some there. Darth Vader, man. I mean, Vader. But the main reason why I'm getting these, besides the fact that they're cool, is that you can see on the back there they got these track sets. This one is a two lane battle jump raceway, high speed score zone raceway. And the high speed stunt jump track. Then they got this uh, rapid fire power launcher. They also got vortex spinners that come with a ball. And they got one that, um, dual, was it dual top speed start gate or whatever? Like, but like these track sets, I wonder, I'll, I'm gonna get them because they're like four dollars for this track set. Plus, I think they're 40% off. So I'll get them for like two bucks. I'm gonna get this big, big, big one right there, the two lane battle jump. And I'm probably going to get the score zone one if they have it. I know they had the this, this stunt jump, but I want the loop and then, like, the gap. I wonder, because they're, they're gravity tracks, if how Hot Wheels will do on it. Or if I can hook up a booster to it. Like, that would be cool, right? Um, they look like a Hot Wheel would work on them. I'm like, it doesn't hurt to try. And then even if it doesn't, you know, I could do track time with the Dagadars. You know, you know the balls, you know? They're pretty cool. Um... But, uh, yeah, and then he got, like, I didn't get a card with the wolf. I need to get a card for the wolf guy, because that's, like, my favorite one. Because he's a werewolf. Well, he looks like a werewolf, but he's a wolf. Collector number, I guess. But this guy's pretty cool. He's a wolf. I like wolves. So I got him. He, he actually came with my, uh, um, what you call it? Can't get him on the stand. Come on, there we go. Uh, he uh, he came with the collector, the the case, carrying case. Um, and then there's this guy over here. This guy, he's pretty cool. I like him too. He came with uh, in the two pack, green and red. Actually, he's over there. See him? There's his card. That's this guy. This is his collector number, one thousand four. I mean, I don't know much about these yet, but they're freaking cool, and I'm going to try and get them as much as I can while they're on clearance. I mean, everyone's got those trash packs now, whatever. This is something different, right? So here, you saw this guy. Here's his collector card that comes with the two-pack. Tells you his name is Quayo. Collector number 1004. Collect them all. And then here's the, his info. He's the one-eyed bandit. <clears throat> well, I'm gonna go check this uh, website out and uh, all that stuff. And he's got a what's his tagline? Hand over all your possessions, including your teeth. His quest is for money and power, and he's and the artist of the guy is Scott Terry. But uh, here's his bio. If you want to read it, give it a pause. Cause it's just yeah. Um, but there's what I like to collect. Some of them, anyway. Um. I'll end you with this video with what's coming up next and what I what y'all collect. It's gonna be uh, my haul video, um, but 
<clears throat> here's a sneak peek at my haul video because I got this today and I, uh, I know that uh, I sent the picture of the other one over there that, uh, to uh, actually I sent this one too to, to James Shear my uh, find today I got the uh, retro Battlestar Galactica Colonial Viper 35th anniversary I didn't know that and I've only seen this once and when I saw it, it had a ripped, like in the back, it like was, it must have been like a Christmas gift, and it was ripped, the cardboard was ripped, like there was a piece of tape on it. So I didn't get it. And then I'd never seen it again until yesterday when I was in A&P. And uh, me and my buddy uh, Luna, we were, you know, we hid this and we hid the, we hid this one. We hid that one, and then we hid this one, and this one's going to be in somebody's box. I heard, you, you know, somebody told me that they wanted to open one, but they didn't have one to open up, and, uh, well, here it is, man. There it is. Mr. James, my buddy, my dude, this is going in your box, and I'm going to get your box out as soon as possible. I'm, I'm planning on it for next week sometime. Um, got a lot to do this weekend. I'm going to be down at my uncle's again tomorrow, hunting around. Got to pick up some uh, things at a flea market tomorrow. Um, but uh, that's uh, just to you know leave you off with that. And uh, um, I'll leave you all off with that. And uh, that little piece of info for, for later and uh, don't forget if you haven't subscribed to me which is Diecast the Go Go or uh, James Shear or PB and J 1972 PJ uh, Gabba Devil 12 Charlie A um, Count 5 Diecast channel, Diecast TV channel, which is also DC TV. Then there's a uh, um, Marty Franz. You know, there's a bunch of them out there in our group of friends on here. That uh, and oh, Matt Sly Mites, yeah, Mite, Matt Slycord. He is awesome. He's got some nice videos. He just started. Um, give him a look. He's you know he does watch all collect and he doesn't just collect diecast either. He does what I do. He collects everything. Whatever you like, collect what you like. The motto, the universal motto, started by Ray Screws, Mark. Um, Got to give it to you, brother. Um, so, yeah, this was my What Y'all Collect video, and it was for my latest finds for uh, collecting is Dagadar. These things are awesome. I mean, if you want something else cheap to collect that's affordable besides Hot Wheels, there you go, man. Check them out. If you don't like them, you don't have to buy them again. If you like them, collect them. I think they'll look good next to the Hot Wheels. Um, I think they look good now. <laughs> all right, I've been talking your ear off, um, crazy, all crazy, and uh, stay tuned for uh, um, my haul video. It's pretty interesting. Got some sweet, sweet stuff. PJ and uh, James Shear know a little bit about what I got coming up. Um, going on 14 minutes, guys. I'm sorry. All right, I'll check y'all later. As always. Happy hauling, happy hunting, happy collecting. Peace!